Hey what's up guys welcome back to our channel technology and today in this video I'm going to show you guys how to share password protected folder in your network so you just need to follow me. So first of all you need to go to that computer where you need to share your folder. So in this case I'm using virtual machine because right now I don't have a, a two physical machine. So first you need to go to your my computer and right click on this PC and click on manage tab. After that you will get this computer management window. So now what you have to do, you need to click on local user and groups and after that double click on users and on you have to right click on this blank portion area and you have to click on new user. After that you have to type over there the username. So in this case I will put here test. The password is also I will put this test and test. So username should be test, test and password is also test. So now you have to click on create and before click on create make sure that you have uncheck this option and check this option and after that click on create. So the uh, user is created successfully. So now I'm going to create one folder under C drive so folder name is like test and after that right click on that test folder and go to the properties. Now click on sharing. After that you have to click on this share setting and now you have to add your user which you have created already. So in this case test and after that click on add and change the permission to read and write and after that click on share. So now click on yes turn on network discovery file sharing and after that click on done. Now close this window and right click on your network adapter and go to the network and internet settings. Also you can go through your control panel and now scroll down now click on network and sharing center. So let me show you from control panel So just go to your control panel. And after that from here you have to select category and click on network and internet. After that click on network and sharing center. So you will get the same window. So now what you have to do, you need to click on change advanced sharing center. So now you have to expand all network and after that you have to enable this option which is called turn on sharing and make sure that this option is enabled which is turn on password protected sharing. Now click on save and close all this window and now go to your start menu and type cmd. Now click on command prompt after that put over there ip config command. Now press enter. So I will give you this command on my video description. After that you have to copy this ip address and go to your physical computer and open the run box just pressing windows and R button together. Also you can go to your start menu and type over there run and click on run app and you will get the same window. Now you have to put over there slash slash then IP address. Now click on OK. So as you can see it's showing password prompt. So now what you have to do I put the password over there. The password and username is same in my case and click on OK. Now as you can see I'm getting two folder over there one test which I have shared from here. So now I'm going to create one simple test txt. Let's see is working or not. So just go under C drive and then go under test. As you can see the text document is, document is created successfully. So that's mean it's working. So I hope this small video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button, like button and share button and if you have any queries or questions then comments down below. I will see you guys on the next one next video. Take care.